Hi, I'm Zatara. This is a Katrina or Sugar Skull makeup tutorial. Pull your hair back away from your face and we're going to start with primer. I'm using an HD Sephora primer. I'm using a Too Faced Eye Primer under the eyes and on the eyebrows as well. Let it dry. I'm using cream makeup in white and placing it on a sponge. And I start on the cheeks and pull down towards the chin line. Make sure that the eyebrows are connected to the ring that you're going to draw around each eye. And I'm just coloring it in with a pink and purple eyeshadow. I'm going to use a bright blue shadow on the cheek of my bones to make it look a lot more hollow. I'll also be placing it under my jawline and all towards the temples and uh, the top of my scalp. And again, it doesn't matter what you use to blend, it's whatever is easiest for you. To blend it in, I'll be using my hands. I'm also going to use a dark gray shadow to fill in the cheekbone area so that it just looks a little bit more deeper and more skull-like. I found some pink glitter so I'm just going to use that within the eye socket. I'm using Duo the eyelash glue. I'm just going to line that glue in dots all around the entire eye so that I can place my jewels on top of the glue. And you can use any sort of embellishment here. I've used sequins before. It all works. You can find jewels at any craft store, or if you want to get fancy, you can look for the Swarovski crystals. They'll just shine a lot better. And what's really cool with this glue, it's not permanent, so it won't ruin the jewels. You can actually pull the glue right off and reuse. Using the same pinkish purple eyeshadow, I'm going to draw a line from the edge of my mouth up towards the eye and curving it towards the top of my cheekbone. We'll be using liquid liner for the nose. I am actually going to do two separate nostrils, drawing a flame figure and leaving a little bit of white in the middle. You can actually just fill in the entire nose and make a triangle if that's easier for you. To do the teeth, I'm just using liquid liner, the same liner that I used for the nose. Just drawing the first line from the crease of my top lip all the way to the bottom. I'm going to use some dark gray shadow to fill in the nose. Just going to use translucent powder all over the face so that it's not so glossy. My favorite part, eyelashes. Now I'm using that duo eyelash glue again. With these type of eyelashes, they're a lot more heavy than most. So make sure that the edge of the eyelash is glued a little bit higher than expected. And that's basically the makeup look. You can add any sort of embellishments, draw on any more little squigglies. go crazy with their hair. I'm actually just gonna save some time by getting a piece of fabric 
that you can get at any fabric store and fold in the edge. And then I have clip-in flowers. They're very inexpensive and I'm just gonna clip them. That's what's gonna hold the veil to the head. Well, I hope you enjoyed my La Catrina or Sugar School makeup tutorial. If you like, make sure to subscribe and we'll see you next week.